Number 10. Blackbeard Ship The shipwreck of the Queen Anne's Revenge was discovered way back in the year 1996. In case you're not familiar with the name, it was the legendary ship that belonged to the even more legendary pirate, Captain Blackbeard. The crashed vessel was found submerged off the coast of North Carolina where Blackbeard may have abandoned the ship on purpose. Most historians agree that in 1718, Blackbeard definitely crashed his notorious ship into the sandbar, where it later rusted and crumpled and sank down to the floor of the ocean. But new information says it wasn't so much of a crash as an intentional sinking. Blackbeard wanted to abandon his ship, but to do so in such a way that it looked like an accident. After inspecting the ruins of the broken ship, the experts are pretty sure it was already in rough condition before it sank. Because the Queen Anne's Revenge was such an important part of Blackbeard's image as a fearsome pirate, it was crucial that he was never defeated in the ship. It's likely that Blackbeard destroyed his favorite ship on purpose, abandoning it to the bottom of the sea, just so that his enemies wouldn't see how weak the ship had actually become. Arg, The Pirate Strategy Number 9. Baby Bones in a small Italian village that's been around since ancient times, archaeologists have uncovered abandoned baby bones. This terrifying discovery came over years of excavations at the settlement, about 15 miles, 24 kilometers from the major city of Siena in Tuscany. The settlement goes back to around the 8th century BC, to a time when residents apparently threw away the babies that they didn't want to keep. The researchers were digging beneath the floor of a workshop that was used for manufacturing goods like roof tiles. They found pig bones, goat bones, and sheep bones. But the most disturbing part was when they started finding baby bones. According to Anthony Tuck with the University of Massachusetts, the babies were likely abandoned soon after birth and then left in the same trash heaps as discarded animal carcasses. Speaking with Live Science, Tuck said, This kind of new data makes people a bit uncomfortable. People have a tendency to romanticize the past, especially in a place like Tuscany. When we have direct evidence for this kind of behavior, it can be a little tricky to present. In other words, the Romans didn't care all that much about their infants. When babies died or if the parents couldn't take care of them, they simply left their bodies in the trash, where archaeologists stumbled upon their abandoned bones thousands of years later. Number 8. Forgotten Sailboat In 2010, Abby Sutherland tried to become the youngest person ever to circumnavigate the world by themselves. Unfortunately, the California teen was forced to abandon her journey after she got caught in some brutal storms between Africa and Australia. The mast of her custom boat snapped, leaving her adrift for days in the middle of the Indian Ocean before she was eventually rescued. Because her boat was so damaged, she had no choice but to abandon the thing in the sea and quit her journey around the world. Nine years later, her abandoned boat resurfaced. It was discovered just recently floating off the coast of Australia, covered in barnacles yet still somehow in one piece. According to the South Australia police, Abby's boat was found capsized by a plane scouting for tuna on New Year's Eve. A pair of fishing boats and a police helicopter went out to investigate the wreckage, confirming it was Abby's boat thanks to the unique paintings on its side. The discovery was a bit of a shock to Abby, who has changed her life dramatically since trying to sail across the world. She now has four children and is living in Alabama. She told ABC News that when she heard about the discovery of her boat, her heart skipped a beat. She also said it looked a little creepy after being lost in the ocean for so long. Number 7. Sunken Military Equipment After World War II, hundreds and hundreds of pieces of military equipment were abandoned underwater by the U.S. military. This happened at the island of Vanuatu in the Pacific Ocean. Rather than bring back all the vehicles they used during the war, the U.S. thought it would be a bit easier just to dump them all in the water. Out of sight, out of mind. Saving the environment wasn't exactly high on the list back then. There are bulldozers, forklifts, tractors, and all kinds of different machines that were used at military bases in the Vanuatu Islands. The place where all the pieces of machinery are dumped is called Million Dollar Point. Why is it called that? Well, because the machinery was worth millions. There's not much new to be found here. Million Dollar Point has been a popular tourist attraction for years, with divers able to swim down and explore the wreckage of construction equipment thrown away by the U.S. military. Would you like to dive down here and check out all this abandoned underwater equipment? Let us know in the comment section down below. And if you're liking this video, be sure to hit the thumbs up and subscribe buttons if you haven't already. Number 6. Stacks of Cash an urban explorer checking out an abandoned house just about got away with a whole heap of cash. It happened in January 2014 when Dave got off work early and went to check out a decrepit old house that he'd heard about from a friend. When he arrived at the abandoned property, he was thrilled to find it in complete shambles. The place was literally destroyed, falling apart, filled with all kinds of spooky items like old wheelchairs, rusted tools that could have come from a torture chamber, and weird old black and white portraits. Oh yeah, and a whole lot of money. 
When Dave was looking through the house, he found a yellow hardware bag filled with $7,000 in cash from both the US and Canada. The cash was from the 1960s, but rather than keep the money for himself, Dave actually managed to track down a number of the people who used to own the property. He got in touch with the previous inhabitants of the house's granddaughter and then sent the $7,000 to her. As to where the money came from, the granddaughter revealed that her grandparents had probably been stashing cash they made at their fruit stand away for a rainy day and then forgot all about it when the house was abandoned. Number 5. A Pot of Gold A demolition team in France was called in to rip apart an abandoned house. Tearing down an abandoned structure is nothing new, but what the team found inside the place left everyone in total shock. As they got to work tearing down the building, they discovered a lead container filled to the brim with gold coins. Whoever abandoned this house also abandoned a literal pot of gold. The workers found 600 Belgian coins, all of them dated to 1870. They were even stamped with the likeness of King Leopold II, who reigned from 1865 to 1909. According to what experts said in the local French newspapers, the pot of gold could be worth upwards of $120,000. Unfortunately for the builders, they probably won't see a lot of that money. French law says that abandoned treasure is split 50-50 between the finders and landowners. Then, after the crew splits it with each other, their bosses, and their company, they'll probably be left with nothing except a single gold coin each. Do you agree with that law? Number 4. Soviet Missile Launcher The crude shell of a Cold War missile launcher was recently discovered in a Russian forest by a random guy having a weekend adventure. The guy's name is Oleg Tsurkin, and he got a bit more than he bargained for while taking an ATV ride through a remote part of a Russian woodland. He was cruising through an area of the forest normally too swampy to pass through. However, because of the unusually dry winter they were having, the muddy swamp was stable enough for him to get through on his ATV. He ended up in an unexplored area that he'd never seen before and was shocked to discover signs of human activity. The first thing he came across was a barbed wire fence covered in rust. Curious, he pushed his way through the barbed wire and continued until he came upon an abandoned missile launcher. He decided to investigate. The vehicle had been out of commission for a seriously long time, with all its important parts missing. The engine was gone, there were obviously no missiles, and the vehicle had been pretty much torn apart piece by piece. It definitely needed more than a boost to get it going. And while we don't know why this missile launcher got abandoned in the middle of a forest, it probably had something to do with the collapse of the Soviet Union in 1991, when thousands of pieces of military equipment ended up getting abandoned overnight all across what was once the mighty USSR. Number 3. The Ekaterinburg in 2011, a powerful Ekaterinburg Russian submarine almost caused one of the worst nuclear disasters in history. The Ekaterinburg, which just so happened to be stocked with nuclear ballistic missiles, had made a quick stop before going back out on patrol. The underwater vessel was going to have a little bit of welding work done to its bow. That was when something went wrong. The welding equipment lit the wooden scaffolding around the submarine on fire, the fire spread to the interior rubber anechoic coating, and the flames raged for almost a full 24 hours before crews managed to put the fire out. The scary part is that if the fire had managed to reach the nuclear ballistic missiles, the resulting explosion would have probably flattened the nearby town and its population of 300,000 people. It would have also blown radioactive dust over a huge area, resulting in tons of radioactive harm. Even though the missiles never went off, the submarine's life was pretty much over after the incident. She did have some repairs done after the fire and returned to service three years later, but was ultimately abandoned. The submarine was then officially decommissioned in 2021. Number 2. Moldovan Nuclear Bunker In the 1970s, nuclear bunkers were all the rage, not only in America, but also in Europe. Leaders of Soviet states began frantically building nuclear fallout shelters where they could seek refuge in the case of a devastating blast. Most of these nuclear shelters have already been reduced to rubble, lost altogether, or are still hiding in secret military zones. One such bunker is still open for the public to see, located in the small European country of Moldova. The bunker is called Object 1180, and it's really nothing more than a giant metal cylinder about 180 feet feet 54 meters tall and 100 feet 30 meters in diameter. The huge metal tube was embedded in a shaft blasted into the ground and fixed to hydraulic cylinders. The hydraulics would move the tube deeper underground in case of a nuclear strike. But Object 1180 was never completed. When the Red Army abandoned the project in 1991, the unfinished base was forgotten. Locals quickly descended on the project and ripped apart everything that was valuable. Today, it's still sitting there in the middle of the forest like a big rusty bucket half stuck down a well. Would you be interested in checking this out? Let us know in the comments section down below. Number 1. Creepy Doll Factory 
There's a place in Spain that is creepier than any place you can dream up in your wildest nightmares. It's a terrifying abandoned doll facility with hundreds and hundreds of half-made human dolls scattered across the factory floor like dismembered bodies. The factory is cold and dark on the inside, with molds and casts in the shapes of human body parts stacked against the walls. There are also arms, legs, torsos, and heads thrown about as if the place had been hit by a tornado. And yes, some of the heads are still even on the factory line, held tight by pieces of machinery that will never run again. It looks like a robotics lab where someone was trying to create their own army of Terminators. It's not exactly clear when or why the factory was abandoned, but it definitely happened overnight. It looks as if manufacturing stopped abruptly. Everyone was told to leave, and that was the end of that. What's the craziest abandoned thing you've ever discovered? Let us know about it in the comments down below, and thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit subscribe and come back again real soon for another awesome video right here on American Eye.